So last year, 2019, for, so again, hi, my name is Christopher Price from Keller Williams Central 75, your favorite realtor, about to tell you some stuff about the uh, economics of last year and where we sit looking forward. Uh, so last year, new listings, we had uh, 20,893 compared to 22,915, which means less new houses on the market by 8.8%. Um, and the pending sales throughout the year, uh, 19,800, I'm sorry, 19,084 this year compared to 2019 having 17,866. So that was up. 11.8%. Uh, so that's good. Closed sales, 18,669 versus 2019 at 16,953. Again, up over 10%. The average sales price up 6.4% to 402, 319 from 378.34. So really strong. And there's my invite to Chamberlain's. Love it. In case you're wondering, Chamberlain's phone number. Um, and our average days on market is actually down 47 days to six, from 60 days in 2019. And it's actually lower now. I'm still looking at 2020. So it's down 21%. And our months of inventory is at two months versus in 2019, we had 5.4. Now, folks, this is where it starts to get interesting because we're going to move into this year, and again, I apologize for not being able to share my screen with you folks, um, unless I actually can over here on Facebook and it's showing it and I don't realize it. Uh, I wanted to start off with our month supply. Right now, oh, and I'm on the wrong screen at that. So we've got in Collin County, 0.7 months of inventory. We're down 73% over last year. So 73% so over last January. Denton County, down 0.8. So if no more new houses come on the market this month, we're done. You know, there's no more houses, which I know is not going to happen, but come on, folks. That's really driving prices up. So if you're in a home right now and you're thinking you need something bigger, you're thinking you need something smaller, it's a perfect time to take advantage of this seller's market, especially with interest rates the way they are. Now, I know the Federal Reserve said they're not going to change the interest rates until sometime in 2023, and it's 2021, January right now. Regardless, we're still gonna have inflation hitting those numbers, which means as these prices stay low, or as these inventory levels are low, people are gonna to wanna to borrow more money in order to get into that house that house is going to go up in value. So we've got inflation is going to start eating away on all those reserves. Let's go ahead. If you're in a house right now and you want to get a bigger one, give me a call. If it's too big and you want a smaller one, give me a call. Let me be the broker between you two. Get you into the house of your dreams at a price you can be proud of. So let's go ahead and look over here at our homes for sale right now in Collin County. We've got 1,193 homes for sale. In Denton, we've got a lot less, only 1,217. We're down over 60% in both these counties, in Denton and Collin County. The entire MLS only has 13,000 houses. That's crazy. Down 50% over last year. And those are just on the homes for sale. Our new listings, believe it or not, are up, comparatively speaking. We've got 1,002 new listings in Collin County and 957 in Denton. Now, granted, both of those are, got, Collin County is just over 3%, Denton County just over 5 So we need more houses to sell, folks. It, it, it's, this is like, hey, come out and sell me your house because we need to sell your house to somebody else. Um, they're making new houses as fast as they can, but folks, we're looking at six to eight months now on getting you into a new build. So if you haven't already started the process, give me a call. Let me get you started on getting into your house. 972-372-9810. Um, that's actually not going to make much difference to you folks. Days on market. Now this is what's interesting because a moment ago, remember I told you that we had Days on market, 47 in 2019 for the year. 
right now, days on market for the entire MLS is 16 days. Collin County, 13 days. Ditton County, 13 days. These are all down over, well, MLS almost 60%, Ditton County almost 70%, Collin County over 70%, down, over 70% down from this time last year. So we need houses. Um, you know, <laughs> price per square foot originally, we're getting almost 100% on all of our new homes that we're on all of our homes that we're selling right now, folks. 100% of our asking price because we're pricing it right in this market. So, and I'm hearing that people are having multiple offer situations and they can't decide who they want to sell their house to. So please, you know, reach out 972 372 9810. And hey, if you're on YouTube, and you haven't yet, click that subscribe button because I got a subscribe button for a reason. Y'all can click on it. And if you're on Facebook and you're wondering what I'm talking about, go over my YouTube page. I'll drop it in the link at the end of this. All right. I'm not sure if I've got any questions over here on Facebook. Let's go over here and look. Got no comments over here. I've been on for about eight minutes so far. Nope, almost 10. So if, if there's no further questions and there's nothing else to do, Not sure if this was a great one for me today or not, but I had fun setting it all up. Uh, learning a lot about YouTube and Facebook. Market is going bonkers right now. If you're ready to get into a new home and you're worried about being able to, where you're going to live next, give me a call. I actually have quite a few uh, techniques I'd like to talk to you about on how to get you into your next home. Um, regardless of all the other people that are trying to get into that same home. And uh, until then, Christopher Price, uh, the home of your dreams at a price you can be proud of, 972-372-9810. Thank you for listening and have a powerful day.